businesses of menswear and contemporary lifestyle. They both gained their experience as tailors from a young age and recently they returned from a trip uh, in Italy tour titled uh, Piti Uimi where they showcased their work with other fashionistas, photographers and bloggers. Now the event was also an event you know to build networks in the fashion industry while also given the opportunity to showcase their collections on a global platform and joining us now is uh, Momisa Nduli and Zagane Manganye to tell us a bit more about their work. A very good morning to you gentlemen and welcome. Good morning, good morning. Good morning, morning. I'm going to start with with you, when did you the when did you start realizing that uh, you actually have a calling for fashion design? Uh, from a very young age, uh, I've always been a fashion lover. Uh, and twenty when was it? Twenty fourteen. I was in fashion school. Uh, I was in Lysoff. I was doing fashion. Uh, that's when I met Zagane, as he's been my mentor since. Okay. Yeah. So I recently also started my own brand, Mika Dolls, and he's been teaching me everything. From twenty from twenty twenty fourteen. Okay. Yes. So I've always been a fashion lover. Really? Yeah. From from way back. Now Sakana, how did it all start? Uh, I started at primary actually. Because I started by knitting I don't know what you call them. Uh, those the fab uh, the fabrics that we put when we put a lunch box. Okay. I, I used to knit them myself. Oh, okay. And then later on, I actually wanted to use my grandmother's machine, so I was not allowed to use it. And then luckily it was in my bedroom. So mm. I opened it one time and I started making a backpack. Mm. Yeah. And you've never looked back ever since? Yeah, I've never looked back ever since. Take us through your, your, your trip to Italy. What is happening there? How did, how did it come about? And what it means to you as a young fashionista having to showcase your, your products on such a platform? Um, there, it was not really like a showcase. There, it was mainly networking. Okay. Yeah, because um, I've always seen uh, the event on social media. And then I've always... It's like um, we, that's where fashion lovers and um, what you call the bloggers meet. Mm. That's where they do their networking. And, and different brands from around the globe, like big brands, it's where, it's where they come, they showcase the, uh, also their stuff and things. Yeah, so mainly the event is about networking. That's where we all meet, uh, all, all fashionistas from around the globe. Like you said, bloggers from everywhere, yeah. designers tailors from Italy as well. So, yeah, mainly it's about networking and stuff. Yeah, yeah. and I'm sure you must have had an opportunity of networking with other fashion designers, Too sharing much. tips and sharing ideas. Too much. What do you think is the latest uh, trends, fashion trends for menswear, in winter particularly? Because, uh, uh, remember, it was summer when we went, uh, it's summer oh, now it's in su Italy, it's yeah, summer it's summer now in yeah. Italy. So, but Italy is... No, but I'm talking about South Africa, what's the latest trends? Well, latest trends for now in, in winter, trench coats, and you know, you you obviously have to mix your your designs as well. You know, okay. just 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 to be unique. You can't you can't be making the same things. You know, just to come up with new things. But it's obviously obviously your trench coats, your 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 winter fabrics. Like uh, 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 we you, we normally use cashmere, okay. so you yeah uh, in winter you have to change uh, to winter fabrics as well. Okay. So, yeah, just play with the designs. Right. right. Yeah. Now, Sakani, you started your clothing business uh, since as early as 2000. Yes. So, how have you grown since then, and how have people been responding to your products? Uh, uh, as, because I did not go to school for this. I'm, I'm a self-taught designer. It's in your blood. Uh, it's in my blood. Yeah. So, the way I've started, I've started by making alterations. I started... Mm. Again, by making alterations and then alterations, started uh, buying second-hand clothes and and tear them apart and to make a, to get patterns out of them. Mm. So that's where I started. And then the other thing, I don't know how to put this. Mm. <laughs> no, uh, no, it's no, no, it's okay. Now, uh, Momisa, uh, take us through your work and uh, who exactly are you targeting? Well, because uh, I'm, I'm, I'm very young, I'm, I'm 24 years of age, so, and I make suits. So obviously, a lot of people my age, uh, they're not at a point where they, they, they wear suits a lot. Mm -hmm. So my target market is the working class, because okay. it's the people that can, uh, that can actually afford, you know.
Okay. So uh, my, my target market is actually all the people, then my people my age. Oh, okay. Yeah. So you don't have anything for those who can't afford. Ah, well, <laughs> well, for now, I only make suits. I only do, uh, we only make formal way, formal okay. way. So what can we expect you in the near future? Well, in the near future, I, 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 I'll be, start doing uh, denims as well, mm -hmm. because now I'm only doing suits. So as time goes by, I'll go into do, uh, making denims. Cause, right. Yeah, because actually for now, I, I make what the client wants, sometimes in most cases. Okay. But I specialize in suits. I specialize in formal way. Because remember, he's been, I've, he's been teaching me everything I know, you know? Okay. Yeah. Right. So, but as time goes, because I recently uh, opened right. my, my, my brand. No, gentlemen, unfortunately, we don't have much time. But yeah. thank you so much for chatting no, to us this morning. Thank you very much. That was uh, Mumisa Nduli and Zagane Mangane talking to us about their recent trip to Italy where they showcased uh, their work and interacted with uh, uh, fellow fashion designers from all over the world. All right, as we said earlier on, uh, this is...